You see this? Most people think you need hours, tutorials, or crazy skills to customize Linux. But the truth is, Linux customization is way easier than you think. Let me show you why. A lot of people think customization means coding, editing config files, or living in the terminal. But actually, most of the work is done using simple tools, themes, and basic settings. One thing you need to understand is this. Customizing Linux depends on the desktop environment you use, and almost every desktop environment makes it easy. Let's start with Genome. To customize the Genome desktop environment, you only need a few simple things. A dot icons folder and a dot themes folder, the Genome Tweaks application, and your browser for searching the config you want. That's literally it. I've created the icon folder, this, and do the same thing for dot themes, and open your terminal. Install Genome Tweaks. Open your browser. In my case, I'm using Firefox. And go to genomelooks.org. In the side here, look for what you need. Example, we need cases. Now we have one. We come back here and uh, we want maybe an icon so you can go to full icon team. Then you come back here. We can go for the genome shell things. Go to your GTK team. and look for the GTK team you like. There's a lot of GTK teams, guys. You can go for the Mac OS one if you like. So Mac OS Tahu GTK team. The same process, download it, which I have done already. Let's come to our downloaded folder. Dots icon or teams folder so actually this is our Keza this is our icon team you have to copy this or you can extract this quickly and then this is our Keza team extract it as well and then extract the GTK and then the shell team after the extraction copy the icons to the icon folder so beauty dream icon you need to go into it and go into it you need to make sure these folders are available especially the index.steam is available and copy the root of the index.steam folder come to uh, come to icons and paste the beauty dream folder there which you can see right here then you come back to the downloads you get your keza teams which i have keza uh, Aurora Kezer and you can see we have index.steam in this one as well so you can copy this one go to your icons folder again and drop it here then you come back to this place and all the teams folder you've downloaded you can come to the GTK area and then uh, get the one that have the index.team just like the previous ones and then copy it and paste it in the teams folder once that is done just open genome tweaks come to appearance tab choose the Keza that you want in our case we choose arc aurora Keza. instantly you can see my Keza change you come to the lip the icons here then you choose the icon you want we have beauty dream here which 
I would change. So this is the beauty dream icons and this is how it looks like. I would love to go with the cover flow aggressive icons. Then the short thing. Here we have an issue. Don't worry. Come to the legacy application here and choose your team. In this case, I could choose the Mac OS thing that we installed. Now let's fix the shell team issue. Open your terminal and do sudo pacman s extension manager. The installation is done. Open extension manager. Come to browse tab and search for user team. I've installed it already. After installation, come to the install tab and turn on the user team. After the user teams, come back to the genome twist, close and open it again. Weeks. Come to appearance tab and now you can see shell is open. Then you choose the specific shell that you want. In my case, I'm using the obsidian. This is it. Now all you have to do is to log out and log in. I have logged out and logged back in. Let's open the file explorer. This is how it looks now. Open extension manager and install the extensions you see on the screen. Most of the extensions actually have their description under them, what they can do and how great they are. If you come to the browse tab here, we have like billions of extensions right here that you can get that can do whatever you want for you. That is for Genome. Genome is great, amazing, and that's how you can customize Genome as a beginner. You don't need to edit any file. You don't need to open any configs. You don't need to write any code. This is it. This is how simple to do it. One last thing I have to do is to change the wallpaper. I have to open the Genome settings application, let it load, and here come to appearance and you can add a picture for a wallpaper. I'm gonna go to pictures, wallpaper. I'll choose this one, click on it, and voila, I have my wallpaper set. Guys, that is how to customize Genome. So guys, room on the genome looks dot org look for what you love put it in the appropriate folder set it in the genome tweaks that's all you are good to go go to the genome shell extension if you want something new or you want any tweaks to your system now here is kd plasma you can see my desktop is already customized and this one is even crazier it has built-in customizations everywhere open settings and go to calyx and teams and basically start the magic from here it has everything you need you can download new things directly without even having to create any folder inside the kde settings which is seriously amazing do you wanna go crazier you come back here come to windows management and come to windows behavior we can customize the windows behavior everything about it tax switcher i don't have a tax switcher on my tax bar but you see a tax bar switcher and i can also go to the hot corner area like this and you can see this is the tax switcher if you come to desktop effect you can go crazy here if you come to windows rules you can set windows rules just like in hyperland or Niri. if you come to k write script you can also go crazy here virtual desktops also is available here so guys kd is crazy you can do all this without having to create a folder and honestly most other desktop environments are just as simple. They have a team section, an icon section, a few clicks to apply, and that's it. Now there's one interesting thing. Let me show you. There's most of this that if you go to a website to download a team. So let's go to the KD store to download a team, for example. So I'm gonna quickly run through the desktop global team for plasma 6 here quickly and i'm gonna get one i found this one i would like to go to the github repository and get the git link quickly and then i'm gonna 
uh, quickly opening my bank now. Gonna run the git clone command. This is the link I copied. It is already there. Let me just bring to the graphite it me. And then let me do ls. You can see there is uh, an installed RSH in this one. The installed RSH here will help you to install the team in case you can't do it uh, by default or you can't, you can't find it. So the installed RSH is actually a very good thing and an amazing way of installing team. So actually, let's just run the install the RSH for example. Look at example of how this works. Just like that, install is done. And if you have done it with maybe a Mac OS team or anything like that, some of them might even have an option for you to customize the desktop. Install.sh is also one of the best ways you can customize your genome or your KDE desktop or pretty much any desktop environment. And as a beginner, you don't need to do any complex thing like editing the configs or writing CSS scripts. You don't need to do any of that. All you have to do is to go to your browser, search Genome Store or KD Store and do whatever you saw in this video. And that is how you begin to use Linux. And with time, you might become the Linux power user, just like others. You might be rising as well. And this is how you can customize Linux. And this is why it's so easy. You don't need to do any other configurations. Linux is easy to customize because everything is modular. You are not stuck with one layout, one look or one system. You can choose the environment, you can choose the team, and everything fits together. So no, customizing Linux isn't hard. You just need the right desktop environment and a team you like, and maybe a two that makes it very simple. If you want more Linux tips and customization, subscribe and hit the like button. See you in the next video.